Hey, what's good, BT gang? And we back with another banger, man. I was so, so excited to get to this, what we got to talk about today. But before we get to that, man, welcome to BT Sense. I'm BT, and I appreciate y'all for being here. But today, we got a fragrance that I didn't expect to wow me as much as it did. But man, I am wild, and I am so shocked at how good this thing is, man. I wore it today, and I wore it uh, this past weekend, and I'm very, very impressed, man. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get to it. We got Mansara Instant Crush. And I'm going to be letting y'all know if I'm getting a full bottle of this or not. But man, what you hear is true. The hype is true, man. It is definitely similar to a Backrock Rouge 540 for like the opening, I feel like. And then like it just does its own thing. And by that, I mean, once you spray this initially, I'm not going to spray this because I'm trying to save this decan. I'm going out of town this weekend. I need this. But once you spray this, you get that saffron, right? And you get the uh, woods from like the same thing with the Backrock Rouge. But I feel like this is less airy, but it's still airy at the same time. But it's just a little more woody in my opinion. And then you also have that vanilla and some jasmine in this. It's just very, very good. And one thing about this, I'm not getting far into this review, but I don't go nose blind to this. I not go nose blind to BR540. So I'm not like, which one is better for the wearing experience? Don't you want to smell what you're wearing? But yeah, this smells really, really good, man. Really, really good bang for your buck. And it's less than background Rouge 540. If I don't know, man, Sarah's on a good day. You can you can get on a discounter. You might can get a 4.2 bottle for maybe like $70, $80 if you're lucky. They even got red tobacco up there for $70, $80. So man, Sarah is a niche product, but the prices are not niche, man. They're definitely great, great prices, especially for the quality, man. This man, Sarah Instant Crush just crushed it, <laughs> literally. This, that, might, that might be the title, bro, for this video. Cause it definitely, definitely crushed it. Longevity was B Smoke. Both times I wore it, it was like, at least eight, nine hours. And I was with three sprays. I did three sprays. I did one behind each ear, one in the back of the neck, and I did one on the chest. I was covered for the whole day, bro. I was covered for the whole day. I got in the shower. I went to work. First of all, I went to work at six this mor uh, six that morning. I uh, got out at two. I went to the gym at uh, like 2.30, and I worked out. I got home around like 5, 4.30, hopped in the shower. I was still getting whipped in the shower, bro. Like literally getting whistled this in the shower, man. And it is so, so good. So sweet. So loud. One thing I will say is it could be a negative to y'all that's watching this. Is this does have the tendency to kind of lean feminine in a way. So if you if you're scared it, not scared, but if you're not comfortable rocking something that can lean feminine, maybe this won't be for you because it definitely can lean feminine, bro. But um, and it's just the compliments on this thing are crazy too. Like the attention this thing grabs. Like Man, if you if you're not if you're not believing what I'm saying, grab you a sample of a uh, man Sarah Instant Crush, or either get the Paris Corner. It's called Crush something. I heard that has great performance as well. Grab one of those, and if you really really trust me, grab, go ahead and grab them. Actually, no, don't don't blind buy anything. I'm not gonna tell anybody to do that. But this thing is good. Decant it, sample it, buy a clone, see if you like it. That's what I do a lot of the times, man. Sometimes if I'm not sure if I'm gonna like something, if I can't decant it. I'll just buy a clone. And if I like the clone, I'll go ahead and upgrade to the real thing. And that's the one thing I will say this is worth of, man. Because I, I wish I would have got a bigger decant now. But this thing is amazing. And I honestly can say I'm going to get a full bottle of this. And I might prefer this over Baccarat, man. It's just something, that, the the way that this thing is just, I don't I don't even want to say if it's more mass appealing than Baccarat. Because I feel like, I don't know, BR540 might not be that mass appealing. Maybe I just like it a lot, but everybody wears it though. So you would think that it's massive feeling, right? But this is a little different. That's the, thing, the good thing about this. Everybody's rocking the BR540s, but not a lot of people's gonna be rocking Instant Crush, man. It's a niche product and it's not like front page flagship like a uh, MFK is, you know? So this is a you know way to express yourself differently when you while getting like the same type of style, but being different and wearing a different fragrance. And it definitely does the job, man. I would say, uh, yeah, great longevity. Projection is crazy. Um, Siage, crazy. Um, seasons, I would say fall, winter, maybe early spring, especially nighttime, early spring as well. This thing is great. Clemencine, like going to work, only do one spray. If you run an errand, you know, chill and like you can probably even, huh? 
I guess you can dress this up, you know? I guess you, I can, I'm gonna say you can dress this up. This is not a bad fragrance to dress up at all. I would definitely say it does lean feminine though. It can lean feminine and I, my man Tazo said that and I was like, okay, but I gotta, I'm gotta, i gonna take it out for myself and I definitely agree with what he said, bro. But yeah, man, Sarah, Instant Crush, bro, this thing is amazing. I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10, bro. I love this fragrance. I was so, so nervous because I was reading stuff on Fragnatica saying that it smells like an old lady and yada, yada, yada. But I never smelled the old lady that smelled this good. This thing is amazing, bro. Amazing, amazing stuff, man. Man, Sarah might have done it this time. I'm, I'm actually gonna try to check out their intents. I haven't checked that out yet. I'm gonna check out a lot of their, their fragrances, man. I heard uh, my man Tazo said something about the, the, the silver one. Then there's a gold one, and he said it's for, you know, fancy occasions. I'm gonna check that out. So yeah, the man Sarah, you over my eyes, bro. And I started off with Instant Crush, man. Y'all let me know y'all experience with any man's hair fragrances, especially Instant Crush. I would like to hear them down below, man. I appreciate y'all for showing love as y'all always do, man. Thank y'all so, so much. I love y'all. Stay blessed.